Hello everyone, welcome to Rocketex. In today's video, I am going to show you how to transfer BUSD from one network to another using Rocketex. So the first thing you'll be doing is go to www.rocketex.exchange. Next up, you need to connect your wallet. I've already connected the wallet. Let me log out and show you. So here you'll find a button, connect wallet. You can simply click on that and connect your MetaMask wallet. In the next step, you'll be choosing your source network. In this case, I'll consider it as Ethereum because I want to transfer BUSD from the Ethereum network to Binance Smart Chain. So the destination network would be BSE. Here you can enter the values, how many tokens you want to transfer. Let's say I want to transfer 100 BUSD from the Ethereum network to the BSC network. Here you can clearly see that I'm being charged just about 0.25 US dollar as a platform fee by Rocketex. And I'm receiving more or less 100 BUSD tokens once this transfer is completed. Now, there is a gas fee associated with this and you can get to know that after clicking on transfer, there will be a MetaMask notification that will be popping up. And there you can clearly see the gas fee associated with this particular transaction. Now, before uh, going ahead and click on transfer, please make sure that you read this caution note. Once you have read that, you can click on transfer. A MetaMask notification will pop up showing you the gas fee it would typically range from 20 to 30 US dollars in most of the cases, depending upon the network congestion. And once you click on confirm, your transaction would be initiated. As simple as that, this is how you can transfer BUSD from the Ethereum network to the BSC network using RocketX. And remember that we currently support three networks Ethereum, BSE, and Polygon. And this way, you can transfer BUSD between any of the two networks from the three networks available on RocketX. Now, you can see a bell icon here. If you click on this, you can get to know your transaction history or status, whether it's a success or failure or pending. You can also see your initial transaction by clicking here and the status of your final transaction by clicking here. It will take you to a, a different website. In this case, it will take you to BSE scan and it will show you that the initial uh, transaction status is a success. And if your final transaction is also a success, it will show you the status over here as success. Now, remember that the estimated time of token arrival is 10 to 30 minutes and in rare cases it would even take up to an hour so if you don't receive your tokens after an hour you could probably click on help and then you can raise a ticket although we recommend you to wait for at least one hour before raising a ticket you can simply click on i want to raise a ticket and then search for the query uh, you want here if you can't find your related search query you could probably go and uh, click on new support ticket you can fill these details and then submit once submitted you can check your ticket status by clicking here well i hope that you have enjoyed watching today's video if you like what we are doing here at RocketX please make sure that you like, share our videos and also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Please stay tuned for more videos from RocketX.